Well, no doubt, jazz legend John Coltrane is an icon. He was born in Hamlet, North Carolina, Richmond County, due south of the Piedmont Triad. Did much of his growing up in High Point. Graduated Penn High School, which is now Penn Griffith School for the Arts. He's also famous for influencing other jazz musicians worldwide. And more than 50 students across the Triad are spending part of their summer honoring his legacy. Fox 8's Natasha Lagur went behind closed doors at the Penn Griffin School of the Arts to show us how his music still influences a younger generation. It's inside these brick walls at William Penn High School, now known as Penn Griffin School, of the art that legend and high point icon John Coltrane studied music and started his journey to becoming one of the most acclaimed jazz musicians in the world. John Coltrane is so important to all of us. It's an art form that I adore and love. Um, the way you structure things, you can push so much. It can have emotions. That's why we use it in movies and television and stuff. You get jingles stuck in your head so you remember stuff. You, you can like make, tell whole stories. <laughs> Athena Ward is one of the 50 students in High Point taking part in the annual John Coltrane Jazz Workshop Summer Camp, a camp meant to nurture aspiring jazz musicians. We teach them about John Coltrane and his history as a jazz musician. He's from here in High Point. Um, and we also teach them about improv and basic jazz. For Athena, it opens her eyes and ears to the possibilities of jazz. It was kind of nerve-wracking, but it was pretty fun because I get to listen to the rest of the sections kind of play their own melodies and stuff and work together, and I was like, okay, I can do this. It takes a few strings being plucked, blowing through a horn, One. and even listening to your composer snaps. To make jazz at the level that Coltrane once played. Athena carries her classmate with her bass. She sets the tone, rhythm, and flow for the group. Quite the responsibility, but one she embraces. Along with a uh, drum set and um, the piano, because we're where it's considered the rhythm section, we essentially, us together, hold the rest of the group. Uh, if we slow down, the rest slow down with us, but we can also do our own thing as well with keeping it. There is no better way to honor Coltrane's legacy than playing and learning the music she perfected. A big thing in jazz is understanding that we come from our elders. We come from all these musicians that came before, and without them, we wouldn't be playing this music. In High Point, Natasha Lagur, Fox 8 News. Good for them. And the students are the opening act for the 49th Day in the Park Festival this year. If you want to see them perform, that Park Festival is Saturday, September 16th at City Lake Park in High Point.